CC play begins. And what better way to celebrate what they call the second season than a rivalry renewed. It's game one in Tuscaloosa between number 13, Florida, and number 10, Alabama. And we welcome you here to Road Stadium, Gray Robertson, alongside my three-time All-American partner, Kaylee Tao. And Kaylee, anytime the Gators and the Tide get together, you know the Otis in the three hole. Back to Beaver. Little PFP to retire Falby. When they do come in the zone, she has so much speed. She can leg out a single, and she can also drive it off the wall or over the wall. It's a little nubber to Kahalen, and the throw is in time for out number two. Got her. Kayla Beaver says, no problem. And she gets a strikeout to in the inning. After missing some time from injury, she's on deck. Dukesher and Giles waiting. And there's Jenna Johnson. High fly ball to left, but the wind will catch it, and so will Otis. One down. That missed, and Esman draws the walk. One on, one out for the Tide. 3-1 to Dukesher. That is sky high. And the catch is made by Kowalewski for out number two. Cannot hold it down in the circle because she has been awesome so far. Giles sends that up in the air. Erickson will track and make the catch. A little wobbly, two in the inning. Sharply to Kahalen, and the recovery is high. Erickson will reach, and the leadoff is on for the Gators here in the second. Team and how much success they're having on the offensive side. Called strike three. Beaver responds after the error, and there's one down. That's well struck. White cuts it off. Erickson will stop at third, and it's a one-out double for Reagan Walsh. Florida's in business here in the second. And stands at third now. Two in scoring position for Kowalewski. Back to Beaver. She caught it and then threw to first just to make sure. Two down. Brown, base hit. Florida's on the board. A second run will come in thanks to the freshman Ava Brown, and it's 2-0 Gators here in the second. This Florida lineup is already making the adjustment on these inside pitches from Kayla Beaver. Ava Brown just getting her hands there, hitting it hard through the infield, knowing that anything through that infield is going to score two runs. For her first hit of a season against a Power 5 opponent, She'll strike out looking, but Florida strikes first thanks to the two RBI single from Ava Brown. 2-2 to Kinley Kahalen against Rothrock. Skied. The freshman Williams battling the wind is able to make the catch for out number one. In steps Bailey Dowling on her senior day. First pitch, well struck to left, but once again the wind catches it. And Otis is there for out number two. Payoff. That's ball four. And Hevlin will scamper to first base. Another base runner for the Crimson Tide. Ups. Payoff from Rothrock. Cold strike three. The freshman from Florida. Sits down the freshman from Alabama. Against Alabama. Back to the circle. Rifled over for out number one. Kayla Beaver has done a good job against Kendra Falby. So Florida, she is their hype man on the offensive side. When she rolls, they roll. And she'll take the walk there. Oh, by the way, also second in the conference. And Chop to Kahalen, one play, she'll make it. Two down. 
end of this game. And I think Patrick Murphy wants to challenge Bailey Goddard, who's had some limited opportunities, and see what she can do. You see. Well, did she go? She did. Beaver tied her up, and she gets out of a jam with a strikeout. On to the other hitters in this lineup. That is slapped and caught by the freshman, Kowalewski for out number one. Blake getting a lot of looks. And there's Johnson sharply to Skylar Wallace for out number two. Got her, Keegan Rothrock ends the inning with her second strikeout. And Florida still holds the lead. Walsh out to right, that's tailing and it's caught. Lauren Johnson lays out. Oh, she can go all out for it. That is so risky because if that ball lands, that's gonna be a triple, but Lauren Johnson secures it for an electric play on. Abby Dukcher will step on first base. Two down. Two nothing Florida here in the top of the fourth. Slow roller, Kahalen has time and ends the inning. One, two, three for Beaver. Eek. Another payoff. Dukesher, well struck to center. That's tailing from Falby, but she made the catch. One down here today. That one got dicey at the end, but Falby made the grab, and now Marley Giles reaches on the hit by pitch. And this will be another one. This time to Wallace for out number two. Dowling to center, and there's Falby once again. A couple well-hit balls by Alabama, but the Florida defense has been there all day. And we go to... Got her looking. Another strikeout for Beaver. Give her five, and four have been looking so far today. There's Kahalen. Good throw, two down. Two, two. Got her. Kayla Beaver strikes out Wallace. And Another full count. Payoff to Hevlin. Called strike three. Rothrock paints the inner half. And that's a base hit. Lauren Johnson's on first either way, and Alabama is aboard here in the fifth. 2-2 Two -two from Rothrock. Skied, and this will stay in play. Kowalewski had to adjust with the wind swirling, but two down. There goes Lauren Johnson. The throw will mow her down. We said it earlier, one of the best. And the heart of the Florida order, 3-4-5, set to face Beaver. And she will field her position to retire Corby Otis to start things off. And Lauren Johnson will watch a single drop right in front of her from Jocelyn Erickson whose strong day continues with a one-out base hit. One, two. Called strike three. Another K looking from Kayla B. And there's ball four. Two on for the Gators with two outs here in the sixth. Dean. Kowalewski backhanded by Broadfoot. And the inning ends. Beaver gets out of a jam. Johnson jammed. One down. And for the sixth straight inning, 
the leadoff does not reach. A lot of success with that today. Larissa Pruitt lays down a bunt, but the throw from Kowalewski gets her in plenty of time as the Florida defense once again comes up handy. Dukeshire high in the air towards Otis, who will make the catch and end the inning. Keegan Rothrock. Here's 101. Over to Hevlin. One away. Got her. Swing and a miss from Bernard. And Kayla Beaver has strike. Falby has grounded out three times today. And this time a little flare that's caught by Kahalen at short. Two in the inning. The 100th pitch for Rothrock. Ball four. And for the first time today, Alabama has the lead off a board. First pitch out to left and running in is Otis for out number one. Three one to Dowling. Back up the middle. It'll roll right to Wallace who steps on the bag for out number two. Hevlin sends it high in the sky. Falby looking for it and she'll make the catch to secure the victory. Keegan Rothrock, a complete game shutout and it's a statement made by the freshman pitcher for the Florida Gators. To get the win. Florida wins game one, game two coming up tomorrow here in Tuscaloosa. For Kaylee Tower and our entire amazing, hardworking SEC Network crew, I'm Gray Robertson saying so long from Tuscaloosa, where the final score is Florida 2, Alabama 0. Thank you so much for joining us. Come back tomorrow for game two between these squads.